All right. When I sit alone, I think of you of all the things we do and I wouldn't ask for more. And when I'm walking down the street, I smile too lightly because everything goes perfectly and I just want you. Somehow the trees are lying perfectly. I feel like something's missing. It's the sun. I waited for you for so long. She's got the name. It sounds like the Greek goddess Terra. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> and Welcome the voice like Faith Hill. Exactly. Yeah. Right. Thank you. Thank you okay, so I'm gonna stand okay. right here, so we can be. You can be in the middle. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, <cool. laughs> Thank uh, you so much for having me on Fresh Food. It's exciting. I know, right? Last time I saw you, you had other friends. Yes, I was with Ascendance here. Yeah. Yes. Uh, now you're solo, of course, uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> talking about your craft and your. Well, you did mention uh, the last interview that you are also a singer songwriter. Yes. Uh, yeah. You perform internationally. Yeah. <laughs> um, are you excited, you know, to be here solo? Uh, it's quite nerve-wracking, to be honest. I've always had my team, so but it's a nice, my first time performing on TV. Mm -hmm. So it's like right. excited and also, yeah. You're a natural. Yeah. I mean, that voice, it's just really awesome to hear. And that, that song, is that your song? Thank you. Yeah, it was my song. I guess it was driving me crazy, so I had to write it. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. Very catchy, I must say. I'm going to go download it. Is it on Spotify? Already? It is on Spotify, yeah. yeah it's on Spotify go. and iTunes. So we're looking yeah. forward to more music from you. But tell us about your mission, because... Uh, when, when we got your, your profile, your bio, it says you have a mission yes. to change the world with music. 
Um, how is that working out for you now? I mean, in this condition, this um, it's kind of cool in the sense that as much as we are all separated in our own homes around the world, the whole world's on standstill. But through music, we're able to connect and bring people together. So I've had the wonderful honor and privilege of performing internationally in different countries and having mm -hmm. playing my original songs and talking about messages like uh, yeah, being like happy, finding happiness, talking about ego, solving like problems like depression through song. Wow. So it's connecting people through that from like, right right so let's talk a little bit about your song crazy yeah. um essentially what's the song about uh okay. where was your inspiration you know when you wrote it <laughs> somebody making you a little bit crazy yeah. well, to be honest crazy was a song that every time i was in the car mm -hmm. when we could drive uh, i would always think like i want to play a song called crazy but i couldn't think of anything the okay. closest right. song was another song crazier by taylor swift when i would listen to that i was like that's nice but that's not the song i had in mind just kept okay. going crazy so i was like okay if i have to write this it's like two months of bugging me and driving mm -hmm. me mad. So the message behind crazy is a lot of times whether in relationships with people, with your family, with yourself, you will go crazy. Mm -hmm. Most of the time it's you're crazy annoyed, you're crazy mad at someone, you're like, oh, gramnya. But you'll forget about all the crazy good times you have with people. So sometimes that relationship goes down the drain. Right. So focus on the good things, the crazy good things. It's That's a nice song to mm. sing to them though. If they're driving yeah. you crazy and you sing that, crazy. they'll be like, okay, yeah, I'm driving <laughs> you crazy, but... Crazy <laughs> bagus, tak bagus juga. <laughs> yeah, so it's, a, it's, it's, it's either Either or, depending on how you look at it, right? Yeah. Um, has the MCO made you crazy though at home? <laughs> Uh, it was. I think mm -hmm. everybody was stuck like, oh my god, what do I do? Yeah. How do you do things online? Mm -hmm. uh, what are we just going to sit home for like one, two weeks at the time? You yeah. know, it's going to be two months. But uh, good thing is the MC got me to try out new things. Mm -hmm. Like I never would have tried out online performances. I ended up doing like an opening ceremony online for like a webinar. Wow. And I got everybody sing along on Zoom. That was crazy, but mm -hmm. it was still a success for that. And then... I got to perform like in Spain. Mm -hmm. I was like, how are people going to react if they don't understand what I sing? But turns out everybody's fine overseas too. So Everybody yeah. speaks music. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a la universal language. That's right. So talk to us about your influences because when, when we were listening to you just now, I, I was getting a Faith Hill vibe and then and then the way you curled your notes, it sounds a little bit oh God, Alanis you're so, Morissette. You're so attentive, I'm scared now. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, it's, 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 a, it's a voice, you know, it kind of draws you into the performance. So at first, I told her Faith Hill. Then just now, I got an Alanis Morissette vibe from you. So, who are your influences? A lot of people say I do sound like Alanis Dang Morissette, you know. and See, I'm like, thank you. <laughs> but, oh yeah, you do. Yeah, I really look up to people like uh, Beyonce. Those are like my ideal performers, and mm -hmm. also Michael Bublé. I like them a lot as people mm -hmm. and as performers mm -hmm. and singers, of course. Mm -hmm. Right. So awesome. I got a very Avril vibe for yes. me. Yes. Avril. <laughs> it was very <laughs> early yeah. Avril. Yeah, yes. very early when she was, you know, punk still rock. punk rock, yeah. very raw. So Avril uh, Pamela, all that. Yeah. yeah. So uh, definitely Avril, yes. movie, right? Uh, your favorite Avril, Avril song? Smile. I think that was the first oh. song I tried to learn when I was like tw 11 or 12. I couldn't sing it at the time, but I would like, I want to learn this song. And I can you play it a little bit? I can sing it. Yeah. And that's why I smile. It's been a while. Since every day and everything has felt this right. Now. See, that, that's the yeah. Morissette yeah. in yeah. you. <laughs> yeah, I get it. I, 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 saw, I heard it. I heard it. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, and we wish you all the best with your career. Can you, can you share uh, your musical love with our fans right now? Tell them where they can get you. Uh, you're on Spotify, uh, YouTube, all, all your links. Just okay. Put First it out there. of all, you have to know how to spell my name. As much as I love my name, a lot of people get it wrong. <laughs> it's H E E R R A A. If you search anything else, you can't find me. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so many R's, so many A's, yes. so many E's. It's like double my, E, double A. And my mom, I think she planned me to be like Beyonce, but to be honest, Indian people have numerology. That's why it's like <laughs> that. So <laughs> it's not a star name, it was Indian name. But uh, you can find me on Hira Official, H E E R R A A, Official. Uh, my songs are on Spotify and they are also on iTunes and uh, Instagram and everything. I'm posting stuff there. So they get the pronunciation right? You're the Greek goddess Hera or Hera? Hera. 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 Yep. There you go. Uh, Hera win. Yes. Stay on heroin, no? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try, guys. I'll try. <laughs> but yeah, I uh, want to know for this year, what are your, your musical plans? Uh, whether or not, you know, you are planning to release maybe another song, an EP maybe? You should. Or, or going on, you know, another virtual concert? Yeah, I've been doing a virtual world tour, so that's mm. crazy. Um, I've recently had like a song out called The Girl Who Love. That mm -hmm. was really popular in Germany and UK. Mm -hmm. But uh, I have another song in the works. It's really, really uh, dope. <laughs> it's cool. But it's 
much more different than the singer-songwriter style. It's very EDM, very modern. Whoa. Okay, I can't wait for that. And I know our, our viewers out there are, are just as enthralled by your voice as we are. So we're looking forward to having you back on the show yeah. and telling us how post-MCO is working out for you and uh, sharing more music. Thank you so much for coming on board. Thank you so here. much, guys, for having me. All right. So we're going to take... It's crazy, crazy.